I wanted to say thank you, uh, Mr. Neely, Dr. Neely, for just offering us the logic. And I wanted to ask you, for one, is your book being used in any college course curriculums that you know of? Not that I know of. And I think that if it shows up in, in, in a pronounced fashion, it is my opinion that it will be denounced by anybody on a college board or a high school board or a high school curricula anywhere, simply because we're in the system of white supremacy. What I'm talking about is actually getting rid of the system of white supremacy. I mean, that's pretty well in your face. And that is the only government that is on the planet that is recognized, all right, as a real government by everybody. And so if I started, if my book starts moving around in classrooms, the white supremacists, you're talking about the second area of activity, education. They're not out to dismantle the system of white supremacy. If they wanted to do that, they wouldn't have to wait on a Neely Fuller to come along and tell somebody it needs to be replaced with a system of justice. They could do that themselves. They could do that overnight. They could do that in 15 minutes. They have that kind of competence. Why? Because they have put together that system. They hold that system together rigidly. The system could completely disappear because they want the system of white supremacy. That's why they, no one who really speaks seriously about it and trying to really figure out how it's put together so it can be taken apart. They don't want that voice going around. And anybody who tries it, including me, I always say, I'm working against myself on a personal level because if, it, if what I'm doing ever really catches on and really begins to work, I don't even know which, whether or not it will work, but I believe it will. That's well, it anybody, is anybody who comes up with anything that's going to really dismantle the system of white supremacy before the white supremacists are ready for it to dismantle, that person is going to be in big trouble real quick. And when I say in big trouble, I mean trouble that can't be avoided. In other words, they'll make toast out of me in no time flat and make toast out of every argument I presented because they know how to do it. They know how to distort everything. But they'll only do this if it's effective.